Today, a solemn goodbye to Lakeland police officer Paul Dunn. Motorcycle officer died in a crash just last week on his way to work. Action Air One flying overhead this afternoon as hundreds of first responders paid their respects. And ABC Action News reporter Andrea Lyon was there as law enforcement rode by his side for the very last time. Retired U.S. Marine, family man, Jim Rat. Paul Dunn was in love with life on the road. That's what he lived for. That's what he died for. His last signal for help, his Harley's flashers. After crashing in the dark on Lake Miriam and Lakeland Highland Road, Officer Dunn was on his way to work. Paul loved his job and was very proud of being a motor officer. Today, the investigation set aside for a moment to honor what Lakeland PD and other agencies lost. It's enormous. It was enormous. Paul was a friend more than he was a colleague. 20 plus years in service, but his latest calling was to be a husband, marrying his new wife, Laura, just months ago. He saw something within Laura that righted his world and negated every piece of adversity he had ever encountered in his life. The sun rose and set on her. Despite two Polk County women and their effort to save the officer, Dunn died, leaving behind three adult children, two stepdaughters, and his giant sense of humor. And the same hardcore Marine veteran warrior with an addiction for working out developed the most curious affinity for cats. <laughs> a lot of cats. The Gator fan and gun lover with a legacy fellow officers say won't be lost. The world's a little sadder without him. Paul, you were as close as an older brother to me as to get. You'll never be replaced. You'll never be forgotten. I love you, bro. Investigators are still looking into what caused Officer Dunn's crash last Thursday, whether it was an accident or another vehicle caused it. In Polk County, Andrea Lyon, ABC Action News.